Hello everybody and welcome to Locking Paul. Uh, today I'm just going through some old crappy locks I got. This one here is made in China. It's a 30 mil millimeter lock. I also have some other locks like this crappy Chinese one. 40 millimeter. This old master lock. Little tiny guy. And I got a fortress here. I'm hoping maybe there might be a spool pin or two in there. And uh, what I'm doing is I'm going through and I'm reaping parts, pins and springs. Mostly springs because I am out of springs pretty much. I only have a few left. And this is also a video to show off how well the Dremel 7300 works the handheld one that I got from Bronx uh, I've already done a couple locks I've recharged it so it's at full power now and I've got a grinding disc on there that's worn down a bit and uh, let's see how long it takes to uh, cut the nibs off of all these see how many I can do here we go That's one. Let's go on an angle and see if we can't just cut it off. Another one. So I think it's probably better to just go from the top. Not so much pressure on it. it runs a lot smoother. Yeah, I really enjoy this thing. It works really well. No cord, no baloney. The only downfall is that the harder you run it, the more you're going to have to uh, recharge it. But other than that, this thing really works awesome. It's got a great little turbine in it. There's three. Okay, so, yeah, so, it works pretty good, like, 
it's got enough jam so that you could do quite a few projects with it like and as long as you run it well and you don't bind it up and like grind on her too hard uh, it works really well like uh, I love this tool man it's awesome yeah wouldn't trade it for nothing yeah, I got a little bit of disc left on here I'm just gonna go a little more but I'll probably only get to do one or two of these and then I'm gonna have to switch it up this is brass now tougher than that bending steel. So yeah, it works really good. I love this thing. Dremel, man. If I can be quick here, pretty much this video, all this one is, is going to be like uh, just showing how well this tool works. So I was pretty much down right to the ring on that one. So I'll just throw a new one on here. Yeah, and this is the quick, uh, what do you call it? Quick release one. Let's do that. And there it's on. Just like that. Deadly little tool. Yeah, thanks a lot to the man who sent it. Love this thing. Here's a little bigger wheel now. Seems to cut a lot better. Seems like it takes more energy to spin the big disc wheel. Yeah, we're really putting the grind to this thing, so it's a good, good uh, test of how the Dremel 7300 works really well. You can tell we're starting to lose a little bit of power, but yeah, we've just grinded through four really nice sized nuggets there, and I'm sure I could get a quite a few. I'd get another lock out of it for sure, but I'm not going to drown you guys with that. Anyhow, thanks for checking out that test run. Everybody have fun and keep on picking.